You want to find people that are good at what they do. You know, you don't want them to gouge you with high prices, right? We, we teach our students how to negotiate to keep the prices as low as you can, let people know you're going to be a repeat customer and you want wholesale pricing and all that kind of stuff. But as you build your team out, you'll find that you can do more work and you can have more free time because if you want to be an entrepreneur, don't you want freedom? So you're going to have more freedom. You'll be managing those people and managing those team members. And the better the team member, the less management you'll actually have to do. And so once you get that team put together, you'll find you'll be able to do more business and you'll be able to spend more time finding more deals, which is where you make the most money. So teamwork is crucial, not only to doing volume, but even when you're starting, you have to have the right members on your team because you will not know everything. So don't think you're saving money if you don't build a team, because I promise you, you're probably spending more money by not having a team. And you may wind up with a bad back like I have 15 years ago, because I thought I was saving 50 bucks by not having a plumber come over and do it himself. But I knew better, right? So take it from my, my experience, take it from Amber's experience too. Get the right team, build the right team, and you spend your time looking for deals to keep your team busy. And you look back one day and say, oh my gosh, look what I have built. But you didn't build it alone, you built it with your team. I hope that helps.